Okay. Hello you guys, welcome back to another Vivian Tries. This is another as seen on television product. Today we have the perfect cooker. Now, the infomercial looks pretty interesting. He makes pizza. No, he makes corzones. I don't know. I bought all the ingredients here. And we're gonna make it in this guy. We're gonna make the corzone. It's called corzone. I itch cream, I can't remember. You guys know, pepperoni. He also adds peppers. I don't like peppers, so I didn't include peppers, okay? We're gonna try to cook this in here. And based on what they say in their infomercial, it's gonna come out browned, crispy, ooey gooey in the inside. Corazon, who the hell knows? We're gonna do this. Let's see what's inside this guy. And it's small, it makes all kinds of things. That's why I'm excited, because it makes rice, it won't take up a lot of space in your kitchen. And we should have put my hair up in a ponytail because there's a crease in it. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's tiny. It's itty bitty. Good little it is. It is tiny. I hope this works because my rice cooker is a giant one and it's back there. So this would be cool. Okay, how do you open it? Take these little things off. Voila. Pretty easy. Aw, it's so little. What? What? Wait a second. <laughs> what are you what are you cooking in this little baby plate? <laughs> Come on now. Dude. Like <laughs> Is this for like my three-year-old nephew? Like, is this for his lunch? Because this is so tiny. This is too tiny. I was gonna make a cake, but I decided not to. It makes cakes, omelets, meatloaf, all kinds of stuff. Rice, like I said, soup, oatmeal, casseroles. Pretty impressive. I'm not impressed with the size though. It's so small. I'm gonna go wash this so some of you guys don't freak out. I'll be right back. Okay, so it's called a calzone pizza pocket. Okay, I just watched the infomercial again so that I could correct myself. The infomercial does not say how long I need to cook my calzone pizza pocket. They gave me everything else except how much time this would take because it's probably, oh, there it is, there it is. It's in the recipe book that comes in the box. Better not be like 20 minutes. Okay, there it is, you guys. That's what I'm making. Cook for 10 minutes. No oil, no nothing. I'm gonna do exactly what he did in the infomercial so that we can see if this is really gonna work. It's warming up, okay? So I'm gonna put that in there and then we put the lid on just in case. Okay, okay, so it's plugged in, it says warm. We're gonna open this guy. Aren't you guys afraid to open these? Um, these freak me the hell out. So I always feel like it's gonna explode in my face. Ugh. Ready? Am I gonna have to poke it with a knife? Ugh. Fuck, what's going on? Ugh. Oh, there's a hole. Shit. Ugh. Is this a twist it? What the f- Huh? No, <laughs> I did not read the instructions because growing up, we just, you know, punched a hole. <laughs> Really? Come on. Okay, look, it's busting out of the hurry. Oh, there we go. Get off my cutting board. That's where we're throwing this guy. Just like he had it. My pizza dough is looking kind of rough. Another hair day. Should have had a ponytail. Okay, pizza dough. Now I'm gonna take off these little pieces because I want it to be all thick. Because then you guys are gonna say, you didn't do it just like he did it on the infomercial. Rolled out. <laughs> Isn't that a song? Roll out. Okay, not gonna roll out any more than that. It's supposed to be a pocket anyway, so I think we're ready. Okay, what does he do first? I think he put some of this on. Hold on, let me pull my hair back. I'm trying to work fast, so this is not a 45 minute video. Okay, he puts tons of this stuff on. So we're gonna put tons of it on. Why does it look like that? Supposed to look like this? I don't use this very much. My mom does when she makes the yummy lasagna. 
This is smelling like burnt. Am I supposed to do something? I did clean it, okay? Don't leave me a comment asking me if I cleaned it. Duh, do you guys wanna see me cleaning stuff? No, get to the point. That's what I'm doing. Okay, pepperoni. He put tons of pepperoni. Is the infomercial? Let's do the cheese first. He has tons of mozzarella. What? All the pepperonis. I love pepperonis. I'm gonna put all of these guys in there. Cause we're gonna try to duplicate this infomercial. That's what I'm gonna do, okay? Do you think it's gonna work? That can be the poll question of this video. Do you think this is gonna work? Give this video a thumbs up. If you don't think this is gonna work, give the video a thumbs down. More pepperoni because he put 7,500 pepperonis on there. So am I, you see? Because, hey, we're testing this thing just like he did. Oh, I dropped a pepperoni. My dog's gonna love that. Now, what is he doing at the end? Rolls this guy up, right? Yeah, just like this. Roll it. Oh no. Okay, hold on. Still got a little bit of dough over here. I guess we can put it right there like glue. What do you think? Not bad. Now, just like in the infomercial, he opens his little thing. He says, no oil needed. He's gonna pick it up like he did. Hopefully mine does not fall apart. Okay, very good. It has a little hole over here, but I'm gonna put a little bit of glue. <laughs> More dough. Just put it in there, just like he did. Okay, done. It's in there. Now I'm gonna close it like he does. That is always harder to close. Okay, you just click this thing down. Okay. And in the book it said 10 minutes. So, forgot my Apple Watch today, but put 10 minutes on the clock. Count it down. All right guys, there is still two minutes on the timer. And while we waited our 10 minutes, I read the instructions again, and I have to cook it for 10 minutes. I have to take it out, flip it, cook it for another 10 minutes. What? So yeah, already the little thing clicked. So it stopped cooking and now it's telling me it's just keeping it warm. So that's a fail. We're gonna open it. I have a feeling, and look, if I click it to keep cooking, it won't, it won't stay, right? It tells me it's done cooking. There's no other buttons. I mean, it's pretty, it's pretty nothing. It's, it's failing really bad right now. See, it won't stay. I'm gonna say it's done. We're gonna try to flip it. But like I said, I'm gonna bring you guys in closer so we can look at this together. It's not even steaming. <sighs> Hold on. Okay, I don't, you can't see it, but both lights are on now. So it stopped. I'm gonna leave it for another three minutes and then we'll flip it. Hey Suri, set a three minute timer. Okay, three minutes and counting. 18 seconds. Okay. Oh my God. Raw, raw, raw. Wait a second, it's kind of cooking over here. Guys, this thing is a fail. I'm gonna give it one Vivian head. I really wanted this one to work. It's so tiny, it's a fail. One Vivian head because I could have ordered a pizza and had it to my house by now. I'm gonna keep going, I'm not giving up. Probably gonna take another hour for this thing to be done. All right, you guys, that is it for another Vivian Tries video. Thank you so much for coming back week after week. If you are new to the channel, subscribe. I put out a new video every single week for your entertainment. In the comments below, let me know if you know of a cool kitchen gadget you want me to try. Don't forget to subscribe so that you are the first to know when I put out a new video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.